Welcome back to Mango Plays Planet Zoo and it is out of beta. It is officially launched. I was very happily sitting waiting for the download to happen. Um, so this is on, I'm recording on launch day, hoping to release this video on launch day. So fingers crossed the quality is good enough, um, but it probably will be a shorter episode, etc. But guys, I'm really excited. Um, I, as I said before, I'm going to do a franchise mode. I have set up my franchise, it's called Fruity. Um, I love the new uh, banners, etc. we have for the franchise. I've picked my banner and I have 800 uh, conservation points, leaf points to spend, which um, is definitely better than beta. I think we had 300 for the beta. Um, but first things first, let me walk you through my plan for um, the zoo and hopefully this works there we go so my plan is guys the, the franchise i'm going to try and recreate famous zoos across the globe um i only know two zoos that are classed as famous one of them being london zoo so close to me another one being australia zoo um and i've decided to pick australia zoo mainly because i love the irwins i absolutely adore steve Irwin. I grew up watching him, um, I obviously was very distraught when he was no longer with us, but guys, I have um, been looking for the past week at uh, pictures, vlogs, etc. of Australia Zoo, and um, I'm going to try and recreate Australia Zoo in Planet Zoo. Um, guys, I'd love feedback down below of any other zoos that you know that are famous that I can use later on in the franchises. But first things first, we're going to be working on this area here, which is obviously the start here zone. Um, and uh, you can see that we have otters, uh, Australian lizards, Komodo dragons, turtles, American alligators, and rhinosaurus iguana. Now, with um, the sort of change between um, the, the zoo and... The planet zoo world obviously there's going to be um areas where which one is oh dear which one is the australia zone that would be helpful to know wouldn't it right according to google and what biome is australia we have temperate forest savannah or rainforest so let's have a look at this again uh temperate Savannah or rainforest, tropical, I guess, would be rainforest. Let's see. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Yes, Oceana, please. Oh, yes. I'm getting there. I'm getting there, guys. Oh, it's amazing. Let's uh, minimize the things I don't need in my life. Um, okay, so name of the zoo. Obviously, uh, we could go for Australia Zoo um etc etc but i am going to just call it crikey <laughs> and a hundred bucks i don't have an issue with that to even unlock a franchise zoo okay first things first i've got to pause it and let's have a look around oh wow oh so we got some Pretty glorious mountainous region. This this is our park. I wonder if we can move this. Can I move it? Because if I look at the map, the entrance for Australia Zoo is all the way over here. So I kind of want to move it. Move? Oh, that's a shame. So, um, looking at the image, what... Um, in sort of Australia Zoo, there's many part, sort of entrances from here. So we've got to, we are going to have to sort of deviate a little bit there because we won't be able to do the many entrances. Although we might be able to, oof, oof. Okay. So we do like for five, that seems reasonable. And then if I do square, no. Hmm. This is a big turning radius. Let's see. Can I make it smaller? I can. So we could do 
So there's something like that. Um, so we could have like little stores here. Here we go. We've got a little bit of so like the parking area. We could put lots and lots of terrain um, sort of like um, greenery in here because all of the sort of research I've done, the um, zoo is very much a greenery orientated. Why have you got herbs? Oh no, it's just because the way it's highlighted. All right. Oh look, it's ah. Oh. <laughs> oh dear. Hmm. Okay, so we got we got a couple of curves there. We've got a couple of um, interesting areas that we can fill in with some either stores or vegetation. It's quite good. Okay, um, I should have done this side. <laughs> Okay, we need an animal trade center. Host haste. Quick as you like. Badunk. And then keep up, we'll wait for a bit. Vet surgery, that seems important. Uh, a workshop is very important. A research center again. And a staff room. There we go. We have a bunch of staff facilities. Let's actually go to the zoo here and hire some people. So we're going to want... A mechanic, a keeper, a caretaker, and a vet for the moment. Right, and now we can look in the animal trading. Oh, it's so exciting. So, yeah, animal storage is empty, which is what I was hoping for. Oh my god, there's bison! Oh, orangutans. No, no, Komodo dragons. That's what I was talking about. We'll adopt that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it looks like the Komodo dragon exhibit is going to be the first one. So, um, these this this area will have to be moved, or maybe I will do sort of like, yeah. I mean, we're not going to exactly match uh, what's there. There is some lizards here, so the Komodo dragons are literally going to be the guys over here that's gonna be cool let's get them a area sorted out most of from what i can see most of the stuff is wood and concrete um so we're gonna try and keep with that can i not get curves in wood barriers do i have to build it out of something else for example because look no there we go. Curved sections. Boop. Do this. Yeah, curved sections are missing. So if I if I do that and then I don't know, increase the length. That's with the equals key, uh, and just do some weird stuff for the moment, and then select this. Can I now? I can now convert that into wood. Okay. Well, so we're building in brick to convert into wood. <laughs> Oh dear. Right. Okay. Although, to be fair, looking at the enclosure the Komodos, they are... It is pretty much a square. So, this will be interesting. There we go. Right. And looking at it, there is sort of like a... A... Uh, Thing. How can I edit you? Can I move you? Move you. Okay, so there's sort of like a a viewing platform platform thing here from what I can work out. I've never been to Australia Zoo, so this is all me making up stuff from the map and images that I've managed to see. Ooh filters. I like filters. Okay. <laughs> My past looks so squiggly and weird. I don't like it. Oh dear. Right, okay, so I'm going to select the whole lot of barrier and turn it into wood. And then this lot is going to be glass. So to convince the um, audience the <laughs> guys to come in now i think 
I'm not 100% sure, but I think Komodos, there's sort of like a water area here for Komodos, so I think they like to swim. So I'm going to do some terrain manipulation and um, get a lake area at the front. Let's go, wow, that is small, okay. Again, increasing by using the square brackets on keyboard. And um, let's see how close we can get our um, thing. Now, I did notice that you have, you selected. So if we do that and then go to here and choose, oh, the textures look better. Um, say rock, but underneath the um, area. So we should oh look at that thank you very much Knox, for um pointing that out to me so um we can just sort of give a little bit of water here Okay, so we have a very basic uh, area here. Let's get some water in. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. I will look at the help tools at another time. Um, so I have a gate here, just going off here. So I'll also have a second exhibit over here. Um, these guys will probably get moved out the back um, once that's sort of done. But first, let's actually hit play and let's move are two um, guys in. So now, am I able to multi-select? No, that is such a shame. Okay, habitat one, and then let's move it to Crikey. Yes, I love it. Okay, um, so inspector arriving in 23 months. Yes, yes, yes. So we have. Um, our caretaker running in. I love it. For our Komodo dragons. I'm so excited to see Komodo dragons. I, I love lizards. All types of lizards. I think they're awesome. So, yeah. Let's see you. Wow. Look at you. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. We got, we got doubles. Oh. Look at you go. I can hear people. Someone's admiring. Oh, look at that. Oh, they, I just love them. Right, okay. The welfare is poor at the moment. I know. Right, social. What's wrong with that space? See, well, I couldn't look it up, you see. No hard shelter and not enough land area. Okay, so they apparently... They don't like water, so... I don't know what I'm seeing in the image. I must be completely wrong. So, what do you like? You like long grass and sand. So choose sand. And then... Batten to foundation. This one. So, this will bring up... Oh, hang on. I probably need to remove the water. Boop. There we go. So, let me get this off. Flattened out for the guys. I'm sorry, I thought you liked water. I thought you were a swimmy lizard. Alright, so that was obviously a very rough just throwing of stuff down. Let's um, add a bit of texture to this. Very random. And then grass long. There is too much grass that's long, so let's get rid of it. Let's bring some of the short grass into here. Let's bring some of the sand up there. Right, let's um, see if there's enough space now. It's calculating. Yeah, it's all right. It's not great. Okay, so we may need to make this bigger for them, which is a little bit of a shame. So I thought I'd got it right. Feeling I'd got it wrong. Okay, finally got the long grass down enough, but still need more rock in here, apparently. Woohoo! We're green across the board, apart from shelter. Let's see, um, I guess social. 
adult population. So two is the maximum adults we can have in here. Um, it says it has severe social welfare issues. I think that is because of hard shelter. So um, let's get a habitat shelter up. Now, I am going to use um, some of the pre-built assets for the moment. Just purely because I am running short on time to get this video ready. But of course, later on, we will go back in and readjust all of our guys. Um, let's get that done. And let's get some food and water. So we want a water pipe. Let's... Um, Let's get a water pipe down as close to the area here as we can. And then we tray large over here. Wow. <laughs> oh dear. So uh, let's call the keeper to the habitat. You. Oh dear, they're fighting. No, don't fight. Oh my god. Oh, wow. Oh, no, no. I wanted you to be breedy pairs. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Um. Um. Boop. Let's sort out the conditions. I don't want them to kill each other. They can kill each other in this mode, which is incredibly um, upsetting. So, it's not big enough for him. Hard shelter is not big enough either. So, let's get uh, a better shelter down. Look at him. He just went straight in to the shelter. Um, let's just dunk that there. Right, hard shelter is now good enough. Let's uh, delete that. I, I shouldn't have picked. I genuinely didn't realize I was picking a deluxe animal. And it was going to be issues from that, from right off the bat. And clearly, I shouldn't have done that because it's just not... It's not working out so well. Let's get some bedding in for him. Okay, you... Is space, that's the big thing. And then enrichment, which I can't get you. It's, it's going to be a real problem. So, let's see if I can... Just increase the space for him. And subsequently her as well. So let's move this out. Whoa. There's going to be an escape. Um, and that's <laughs> that. So wall's back. <laughs> um, okay. Boop. Okay, and then let's uh, grab you. Uh, let's move you out. There we go, and then you out as well. Boom. Okay, right, uh, we can play it again. It's not a problem. Right, you're probably not happy with the grass now, are you? The environment, but are you happy with the space? You are. So, I should be able to move the lady komodo dragon in uh, uh sawinda come on down okay let's get a uh, rock i'm just literally going to throw well not that big um throw a rock in it's gonna be ugly for the moment but i'm just gonna do it as sort of like a blank canvas to get rid of stuff right is that better we are just missing enrichment now. So that 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 is cool. Um you got water. Now I'm going to change a couple of these to glass because we want to increase the money we making. But there we go. First exhibit. It looks ugly as all heck. It's just been thrown together. Need to give it some better sort of dimensions can i add some plants that's what i forgot environment oh, i can so we've got tropical and grassland let's have a look here nature tropical asia and grassland hey 
So we got um Pines, we got Vine Carsons. Ooh, nettles. Would you like some nettles, dear? Please don't say you're going in for a fight. I'd be very upset. Okay, let's uh, do a little bit of play around here. Alright, let's check in and see how they're doing. We, we're not doing too bad here. We're not doing too bad. The terrain is good. The plants are good. The enrichment doesn't exist. <laughs> you get into species bonus. Really? Social is good now, so hopefully we won't have another fight. Um, let's see. What was I hoping to do? Oh, yes. I was hoping to use the heat map. So press H and animal welfare is good. Habitat. I was looking at traversable area. So done a little bit of terrain manipulation, give them a little bit of height and depth and, and movement. It looks like we are good. Wow, it is dark when you come out of the heat map at night time. Oh, you look awesome. Hello. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm very excited to see if we get any a Komodo or Dragon Babies. Um and how that will go. So that is our first exhibit in the Crikey Zoo. Um, I think what I'm just gonna do is, I, I'm not sure if I should do shops. Yeah, I'm gonna do shops either side here. So what I'm gonna do is a little bit of, I'm not gonna say terrain works, it's not terrain work, but frittering, making this a little bit pretty, see, um, I don't want to spend more than 5,000, so... Eh, but let's see how I get on. Oh, 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 dear. <laughs> I forgot to put a keeper hut down. Stop facilities. Keeper hut. Here you go. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, dear, there we go. Right, please feed me, me, me me animals please don't oh they're hungry oh no go keeper but look at my lovely rat work a little bit of lusciousness here i'm quite pleased with it my first attempt to create sort of like a little bit of nature zone we were able to get some additional color in use that new soil texture which is looking great and Ah oh, yes, our Komodo dragons have been fed. <laughs> They've been fed rodents. How are they doing? I can't see them. Where are they? Hello? Komodo? They haven't escaped, have they? Um. So. Oh yeah, we've got some uh, research going. Um, let's do that one then. Uh, animals. Okay, where are you? Oh, you're in here. Hello, you're having a... Oh my god, they are. They're having a snooze. Oh, it's perfect. Well guys, hopefully you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. Subscribe if you're new and you enjoyed. Uh, there will be lots more Planet Zoo content coming soon. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.